Hi everyone, I am Shubham De and I am here on YouTube with my new sketch. So, I hope you all are doing absolutely fine, absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. Okay, my language has been, uh, what should I say, like I have broke, um, like I am feeling so awkward speaking like this. Uh, my language has been what word should I use for this okay whatever so like I broke my language should I use broke or okay whatever so I am speaking very badly maybe or maybe not or yes maybe I guess so so whatever forget it so today so today i am sketching out this character so this character is inspired from one of the folk uh yeah folk stories folk horror stories from assam so assam is my home f state i belong from guwahati and Guwahati is a very beautiful city so uh, this character's name is Bok Bhut Bok means a crane and Bhut in Indian language means a ghost so this is uh, so uh, maybe the uh, the character resembles a crane and a person or maybe a person who looks like a crane but is a ghost a ghost who looks like a crane maybe whatever this could be anything so whatever be it my sketching will be completely based on that character and I have been inspired from few other more artists to do this and yeah so today like I'll be sketching out this character so like i already have sketched out this character you are basically watching out the timeless of this video so yeah just enjoy it so yeah just enjoy So the idea to draw this character arrived in my mind from uh, one of the one of the fellow artists of Assam. His name is Abhishek. He is the co-founder of Guwahati Art Project, along with four other awesome people. One of them is the Red Bull Doodle Art Champion 2014. His, his name is Shantanu Hazariga, many, many of you might know him very well. So he's a great doodleist from India. So like this character, I have I, I was just uh, browsing Abhishek's uh, Instagram gallery and I just found this character uh, which, which is called Pagbhut. It's, it's one of the oldest ghosts. Uh, which has arrived in many many stories and like when we were children we used to like our grandparents used to tell us about this ghost like they used to tell that the ghost lives near uh, old ponds lakes they even like hang on trees yeah like that something like that and like they used to hunt on fish sometimes they also used to kill humans for i don't know maybe food and then later on carry their corpses along with them it's too weird i don't know you kill a human just to carry their corpse or you feed them later on it's like too scary so like if you are crossing a pond then you should be very careful yeah, I would suggest don't cross a pond when it's too dark. Yeah, 
also uh, there's an interesting thing I didn't uh, I didn't sketch that out so the bug booth uh, has its power all his power stored in a lantern not that lantern which you are uh, you can see uh, hanging on this fence this is just a normal lantern which I which I thought would be good enough if I draw it here but that's a different lantern which the bug would carry some say he carries it in his pouch but yeah I forgot to draw or maybe it didn't came on in my mind so so if you are planning to kill this ghost then you should definitely destroy the his lantern but yeah that's the only way but I don't think anyone would kill that even think of killing that ghost isn't it so whatever so I hope uh, like you all are liking my sketch I used like and basically I don't use much things I just use normal pencil to sketch this out and a few inking brushes and yeah that's all few inking brush brushes and uh, blend them and smudge them using the smudge tool and mo what more do I use few airbrush few dry brush and few digital brushes so that's all and yeah that's all nothing more so if you like my art my sketch then please do subscribe to my channel like this video and don't forget to share and yeah while subscribing to my channel please do hit the bell icon otherwise like you won't get notifications you know that better than me okay so please subscribe to my channel also i'll be posting my instagram account handle link this uh yeah instagram link so that you can contact me if you want directly on my instagram too i also do like i also take in commission work so yeah you can contact me there too